I'm getting ready for work. The room is a literal mess because I took out so many pairs of scrubs trying to see which gray shirt matched which gray pants. The closest and honestly at this point, like, I'm just wearing whatever with whatever. <laughs> is thriving however my friend suggested that I try um, putting my hair together in the mornings without spraying water on there because I've always been a preconceived notion that I need to spray water in my hair to like wet it up a little bit or whatever today I just brushed it out and put the gel on there I specifically did that because I didn't want a product overload anyways I'm kind of ready to go I need to go in the living room and put on some of my signature daily Fragrances from Doxy Years. I'm gonna do that and come back. Okay, we smell guys. I literally have like three scrub pants on the and like two shirts or whatever, but those are gonna have to stay right now. Especially because like I literally have two minutes before I have to go. What's I looking for? A new jacket. So it's it's a little denim season. However, the one that I wore yesterday, did I lotion my hands? I wore the white. One minute at this point, literally need to go when it gets to this one. I'm gonna just jump in my Crocs. Everything else is ready to go. I am, um, Jesus Christ, it's six o'clock on here. I'm bugging. Just here, man. my watch and my phone are in sync in the sensor when I unlock my phone my watch is unlocked too and love that for me so it's it's denim jacket weather and I wore another one yesterday but I find that it's a little bit too thick so I changed it today because why not as in literally like why not Better to smell good than to smell funky. Pretty much ready. Robe is on the bed. Everything is literally on the bed. And I can put my pocketbook on my bed because when I'm at work, it goes in a bag before it touches anything else. Even though it's probably still not good. My bed is not looking the best right now, but it's gonna have to work. Where's my car mix? Because that's important. Face mask, jump in my Crocs, and I'm ready to go. I have my face masks on the entryway stand so that I can always remember it when I'm on my way out. Well, I'm about to go. Another day at work. It's just... What time is it now? Wait, where's this light here? Why is it so dark in here? bathroom is hella creepy anyways it's 10 20 and my break is 10 30 but i'm about to go from now because i just want to sit down for a little bit to just be sitting down to just be sitting down okay so i'm about to go on my break as long as my friend is at work we always have lunch together this at this point is 10 20 is brunch okay so we're gonna go do that i don't know if i'm actually gonna eat because this morning i had a huge bowl of cereal and like i'm still kind of full from that but if I don't eat now, I'm gonna get hungry later. So maybe I'll try and see if I can eat something and then um, come back down and I have like a few things to do, honestly, before I wrap up the day. Still a long way to go, but the break normally goes pretty quickly. So like, I'm not even wasting no time right now. And we're pretty much at the end of September. So what I did was I went ahead and bought a Christmas tree on Target for $67.99, dollars I bought a four, 0.5 foot tree because I feel like the last one that I had was was it six feet it probably was and it was just big in the space you know the space is not a lot so I decided to go smaller with the tree and I decided to get a flocked one which I wanted last year but I had the one that I had the year before so I'm kind of excited about it but I also wanted to buy it from early before the prices skyrocket okay so I'm planning ahead of time this time so I'm not spending so much in the last second 
Um, I need to get a Christmas tree skirt. Um, I mean, that, that's pretty much it. I'm gonna just have it sitting in the box in the living room um, storage closet until it's time to put it up, maybe like late October or so. Maybe after Halloween, I don't really know. We'll see, because I want to enjoy it for a little bit longer. But yes, that's what I did. I also bought two um, nightstand lamps for my bedroom and I'm really excited about them. They have gold accents, but I'm trying to mix metals. So I'm mixing gold with the silver that's all over my bedroom. So that should be exciting too. So I'll see when that comes. They just sent me a message that my order was shipped. So that's exciting. It looks a little blurry, but I ended up deciding to come to the nail salon, me and Julissa. So I'm getting a refill, cut them down shorter, and I'm gonna go out to get them polished, but they look cute just realized that i didn't come back and show but i was done getting my nails done i ended up going white i was gonna get like a design on one finger but i ended up deciding against that too i'm like you know what i'll just keep them nice short and white and that be it and here they are so i absolutely love them it's currently 5 9 a.m and i'm supposed to be getting ready for work but i just remembered that i didn't come back I have this box. Do not want to put it on my ottoman because God, I'm praying that the lamp is not broken because they're gonna have to reimburse me. The way that these people just pack this lamp instead of this bag is beyond me. What does it look like? The shade is broken. I'm not even able to explain how they're getting me tight because what kind of janky ass packing is this? They didn't even put on the thing that it's fragile, so they should. You know be very gentle with it or whatever this is horrifying this really is horrifying let me just make sure that these lamps are not broken oh how beautiful is that so i bought these lamps on target how pretty for my nightstand i'm very glad that they're not broken but something is going on with the shade up here now hold on a damn minute i just do not like how they have packaged this Whoever works in, in, in packaging is a piece of doo doo because what is going on? Like, why look like this? These could have easily broken because nobody knew they were fragile. These are stoleum sprays or for the appliances because the stove has its thing on there and the fridge, um, the paint on the fridge is dripping. However, this is like a gloss to go over, like a finishing, and this is black. I need to buy a white one for the fridge. It's another day. But these were what I was excited about. Really excited about them. So they're going to go on the nice side. Hold on. They said that it included the bulb. Where's that at? Let me look at the order. Because I'm definitely going to be very mad. With LED bulb. Includes LED light bulb. No bulbs are included. What am I paying for then? Damage up on arrival. The shades is crooked. It just was not packaged. Good. Look at the, look at the shade. Missing item. It's so unesthetically pleasing. This one daylight white bulb. So I'm gonna try it just to see that it works, that they both work. Oh. Look how this is dented on stay bad. Like why don't stay like that? I hate when I spend my money on things that I'm not, you know, I'm, I'm kind of tight because So I just bought this watch band for my watch. It's a scrunchie band, it's so cute. I should have probably gotten with rose gold hardware. Wasn't paying that much attention, but I absolutely love it. I'm gonna put it on my watch right now. It's also fabric, so I'm probably gonna have to wash it 
use this function shell real often. But that means I can put it further. I'm gonna put it on my watch and see.